Hey there guys, Tyrese Joyner here. This is another 259 Vlog edition. <sighs> Today is the 25th of July. Of course, Smackdown Live will be coming on tonight. So let me guys tell you guys something about uh, the history of SummerSlam. I already talked to you guys about SummerSlam, but not the history of SummerSlam. I mean, SummerSlam is always the best pay-per-view in the WWE in August. Some of the best matches at SummerSlam, like Undertaker against Edge inside Hell in a Cell. I mean, because never before in SummerSlam there has been a Hell, there has been a Hell in a Cell match, and a TLC match. Jeff Hardy and CM Punk. D Generation X took on Legacy. And also Team WWE against Team Nexus in that huge 7 on 7 tag team elimination match. That no holds bar match between Randy Orton and Christian. Brock Lesnar and Triple H. Even Brock Lesnar can see I'm pumping that no holds bar match. <laughs> yeah. Even Triple H against King Booker. So now, so far, the matches that are already made this year so far Naomi taking on Natalia. SmackDown Women's Champion, and the match that, that was already made last night on Monday Night Raw by General Manager Kurt Angles is a fatal four-way match for the WWE Universal Champion. Brock Lesnar, Roman Reigns, Braun Strowman, and Samoa Joe. Every man for himself. But now Raw and SmackDown will continue on talking about SummerSlam throughout August. But now, SmackDown Live will be coming on tonight. And, but not only are they going to talk about SummerSlam, but they're also going to talk about what happened 48 hours ago at Battleground. But that happens tonight on USA. Alright, that's the news for you. Goodbye.